Lecture 9. In this lecture you get acquainted with some possibilities to pay basic income. But first of all, is basic income fair if it is paid to everyone, even to the rich? Some argue that means tests would enlarge bureaucracy and people with needs could fall through the social net. Others say even the rich are part of the society and deserve basic income. But let's have a look to the payment proposals if this question is abandoned. Most of us receive from somewhere money. To show vividly the payment of basic income in different proposals, it is useful to take a graph with x and y axis. The x axis is the gross income, the y axis the net income. If we do not pay any taxes on income, we get a line, here blue, which can be used to compare the payment proposals. In that case, our net income equals our gross income. If we would have a linear income tax, the red line describes our net income. Everything between the red and blue line is paid as taxes. The proposal of Milton Friedman, a negative income tax, shifts the red line at low incomes over the blue line. In that case, all income tax payers who receive an income lower to the inception point get an income from the tax inspection, even those without any income. All people above the inception point pay the money which is used to finance this system. Similar to this idea, the transfer limit models use income taxes too, but they have a kink. At this point, the income tax changes. This point is called transfer limit and may vary in different proposals. All these shown models can work with an additional basic income too. In that case, the gross income includes basic income, as for example in Alaska, where the income from the permanent fund must be taxed. But let's have a look at proposals which do not use income taxes. Basic income is paid additionally to a tax-free income. There are also models which limit the tax-free amount of income, similar to the idea of transfer limit models, but they invert the effect. After the transfer limit, all income, including basic income, is taxed. At least rich people with a high income level won't receive basic income, but pay taxes. Background for this proposal is that there is a specific amount of work which can be done by one person in a specific time. All additional income, which this person receives not by his own hands work, is profit through the work of others. This profit should be shared to the society by paying taxes. At the end it should be mentioned that there is a long dispute what and how it should be taxed as well as for what the taxes should be used. As shown, basic income is one proposal to let all citizens participate at the wealth of a nation.